Hi. Let's learn about the Harami cross pattern. A Harami cross is a Japanese candlestick pattern that consists of a large candlestick that moves in the direction of the trend, followed by a small doji candlestick. The doji is completely contained within the prior candlestick's body. The Harami cross pattern suggests that the previous trend may be about to reverse. The pattern can be either bullish or bearish. The bullish pattern signals a possible price reversal to the upside, while the bearish pattern signals a possible price reversal to the downside. A bullish Harami cross pattern forms after a downtrend. The first candlestick is a long down candle, typically colored black or red, which indicates that the sellers are in control. The second candle, the doji, has a narrow range and opens above the previous day's close. The doji candlestick closes near to the price it opened at. The doji must be completely contained with the real body of the previous candle. The doji shows that some indecision has entered the minds of sellers. Typically, traders don't act on the pattern unless the price follows through to the upside within the next couple of candles. This is called confirmation. For a bullish harami cross, some traders may act on the pattern as it forms, while others will wait for confirmation. Confirmation is a price move higher following the pattern. In addition to confirmation, traders may also give a bullish harami cross more weight or significance if it occurs at a major support level. If it does, there is a greater chance of a larger price move to the upside, especially if there is no nearby resistance overhead. It is not required to trade the harami cross. Some traders use it simply as an alert to be on the lookout for a reversal. If already long, a trader may take profits if a bearish harami cross appears and then the price starts dropping after the pattern. Some traders may opt to enter positions once the harami cross appears. If entering long on a bullish harami cross, a stop loss can be placed below the doji low or below the low of the first candlestick. A possible place to enter the long is when the price moves above the open of the first candle. If entering a short, a stop loss can be placed above the high of the doji or above the high of the first candle. The following chart shows a bearish harami cross in American Airlines Group Incorporated. The price had been falling in an overall downtrend, but then flattened out into a large range. The price moved higher into a resistance area where it formed a bearish harami pattern. Following the pattern, the price moved lower. This provided confirmation and an opportunity to exit longs or enter short positions. The price continued lower for a couple of weeks before reversing and then breaking above the resistance level. Here are four key takeaways. 1. A bullish harami cross is a large down candle followed by a doji. It occurs during a downtrend. 2. The bullish harami cross is confirmed by a price move higher following the pattern. 3. A bearish harami cross is a large up candle followed by a doji. It occurs during an uptrend. 4. The bearish pattern is confirmed by a price move lower following the pattern. Hope this would help. Thanks for watching.